It's the future. My last one? Oh, my, oh, whoa, whoa. That's dark. So my very last drag gig will probably be my funeral because I feel like I'll be dying on the stage performing. I know in my body I'm about to die. And I'm standing center stage at the Palacio de Bellas Artes in Mexico City. I'm 85 years old, wrinkled Asian woman. I'm in a fully rhinestoned wheelchair. Jump off of a skyscraper and like land into a split that's like balancing my legs on like two fire hydrants, but like to a Gloria Stefan song or something. <laughs> I want to channel my inner Bette Midler, and I want it to be at a bathhouse, me just fully naked in a kitty cat wig and a sponge, uh, a sponge bikini. I want to be in Japan. I want 60 live musicians. Girl, I want gold leaf props and just backdrops. Nothing is there except me and the spotlight, and except in reality there's a whole orchestra of mariachi from Mexico behind me. Oh baby, we're in a huge theater. Packed house, lights, stage is set, beautiful swag, curtains, eleganza, full band, jazz band, piano. I'm going to be lowered from the ceiling. There are going to be peacocks spreading their feathered fans. And I'm going to lip sync that MacArthur Park song again because they just can't get enough of it. Flowers are falling and falling and falling, and I think the crowd might know that I'm not okay. But I'm about to sing my last song, and I'm gonna sing it live in a beautiful gown and the only uncockable hairline. And then the fire hydrants would go off. <gasps> That's drama, and then I'd die. I'm doing a ballad, and it's a, it's, it's a powerful ballad, and I do like 14 wig changes. And I just want all my loved ones there to witness how stunning I actually really am. And I'm giving my last goodbye to this beautiful world, this art form, this life that allowed me to live my every dream. And then all of a sudden, my skirt comes off, and then I rip off my tuck, and then wham, the best reveal ever. And if I can't afford all those things, baby, you give me a nice, lovely little sheet up in the living room, and I'm gonna do a show there too, and still be sickening, cause once a queen, always a queen. Oh, well. <coughs> I see a budget. <laughs> Shady bitch. You're like, really? It's a lot of people there. It's my family. Patty LaBelle is sitting in the front row. People are bringing me flowers as I do my last final number. They crying. I'm boohooing. And I'm giving you the very last of me through every tear. And I bow out. And by the end of the performance, I hold on to the microphone my body just collapses and I die. Those little hydraulic things, cause I want that little Britney Spears kind of pink, uh, dip me in the water and come out singing. La, la, la. I'm gonna be singing live. I'm gonna be singing with people that I love in this industry and making music and inspiring people to be better. I'm gonna just have all the tearaways and show my naked old, spray tanned, body glimmered body and just be covered in crystals and give them a show. Spinning with rhinestones all over me and then finishing it out with Beyonce. We're gonna do a wig change like Lady Gaga and then we're gonna have that human hair blowing in the wind, but not get caught in the fan. And I get the biggest standing ovation I will ever get as my body leaves to heaven. Oh my God, that would be so legendary, girl. If I die on stage, with the roses. You were so extra. <laughs> <laughs>